Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of No Man's Sky. Alrighty, when we left off, we were on our way to hunt down a trace of antimatter because we had just recently learned how to make a warp drive, and that is what we're going to need to get further along in space to figure out why we're here. And, uh, well, time to engage the pulse engine so we can get closer to that trace of antimatter, which is another planet entirely, but it's one we've discovered, so as far as I'm concerned, it's mine. It's also got high sentinel activity, which is not good, but we'll, uh, we'll see how we can make that work. For now, though... Atmosphere is colorful. Alrighty. Okay, alright. Okay, well. Okay. Too close. Too close. And time to land at a building. Wait a minute. This is the previous planet I had visited, isn't it? Yeah. This is the previous planet I had visited. That's right. I remember now. Alright. So, since the life support is starting to wear down a little bit, I'll wait. I'll wait until that life support gel is more useful. Um, hyperdrive needs warp cells or warp hypercores. Um, hmm. I did manage to offload a lot of stuff. That much I did do. That's nice. But what is this? I can destroy. Okay. Fair enough. Side. Um. Toggle the camera view so I'm a little closer to whatever the hell this is. Broke out of containment. That's what I'm seeing. Health at maximum. Oh, well. That's nice. Damage mechanism, or rather, machinery. No, I'm picking that up. As much money as I didn't make from selling it, I do not need it that badly. Restore shield. Shield at maximum. Okay, fair enough. Look at that. Ew. Ew. What the fuck is that? Some more sodium. Alright. Huh. Trace of antimatter out of this thing? I guess so. Deserted terminal. Pair by removing corrupted material. Residual goop. Oh, I could just discard it. I don't have to pick it up. Interesting. Terminal online. Selecting key. Decrypting. Okay. Success. The terminal is clogged with an unnerving, pulsating slime. Yeah, I can see that. Nevertheless, it appears to function. As I touch the input panel, the alien substance reacts violently. I make a note to avoid getting closer. Yeah, I'd say, considering this thing seems to also have teeth, that's probably a good idea. The device opens, revealing a single, unblinking crimson eye. It prints out a blueprint for antimatter, accompanied by a strange message. 
You will find us when the time is right. 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16. I have learned how to make antimatter. It requires condensed carbon and chromatic metal. Contained in negative matter and barogenesis... Baryogenesis antiparticles. The vast energy potential of antimatter makes it highly valuable. 95% of existing antimatter consumption is in the powering of starship hyperdrives. Warning, uncontained usage is not recommended. <laughs> I wonder why. Alright. Blueprint recorded to catalog. Interesting. So I just need to make chromatic metal. Okay, cool. Oop. I keep doing that. I keep doing that over and over and over. When will I learn? The answer is never. Uh, put that in there. Good. Um, chromatic metal. How the fuck do I make chromatic metal? I forget. <laughs> uh, shit. Copper. That's what I needed. Copper. Um, do I have any copper? Hmm. Gold, silver, and platinum, but I do not have any copper. Damn it. I sworn I did. The rarer the stellar metal, the more chromatic metal it will produce. Huh. Here I thought I had plenty. Alright, pick up all the carbon. Copper. Copper, copper, copper. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bound to start falling at some point. Scanner recharging. Oh, well, hi there. Hi. Okay, well, those are the planets, or rather that's where I need to go off planet to do my thing. Uh, life support gel. Okay, well that's nice. Some more of that is always nice. I need copper. Finding copper on this planet. Do not recall there ever being copper on this one. Then again, I don't right remember. It has been a goddamn long time. some on my other planet. So I'm going to just go with that. And actually head upwards just so I can break the atmosphere faster. Alright. And we're going to go for colony location. so good. I think. And there we go. Here we are up in the atmosphere. Bring through the atmosphere. 
atmosphere. And booyah. There we are. Planet proper. There's a custom marker near the thing, but I think I already. What's up with that unknown hill? Oh, it's a waypoint. Interesting. Minor settlement detected. A minor settlement. A settlement on this planet? What? What the fuck is this? Just a marker. Is that what I just did? <laughs> Salvage container. That is interesting that that's how I do that. What is that? That's a salt deposit. It's a buried technology module. Okay. These are knowledge stones as well. Munition fragments constructed to fit universal multi tool standard 07 FF1. What is. Th I do not have that. Uh, easily inserted into the bolt caster, pulse spitter, and scatter blaster via the multi tool chip reloading system. But. Okay, well, I guess this is as good a time as any to install a bolt caster. Oh, I need more chromatic metal for that. Eat my butt. Alrighty, well, how about that? That's a, also a pirate deposit. This is a salt deposit. Ah! I'll go for the very technology. Nothing else. Ow. What is this? 
to be true. Okay. Alrighty then. Well, let's go towards the technology module, which is not not that far away, actually. please uh, create store there we go mine <laughs> nothing that I need pyrite deposit. I need copper! Beautiful. That's what I needed. Another very technology module. It isn't that far away either. Alright, well, in that case... Whoop. Ah, could have been bad. That is... Still not that far away. Okay. So far, so good. It's damaged machinery as well. Next to the buried technology module. Alright. So far, so good. Why not? If I'm already here doing a whole bunch of other shit, why not get that too? Damage machinery. There we go. Got nanites out of it. Nice. And now... It's just... Uh, Hey, there we go. Technology module. Salvage data. Nice. And let's store what I just did. Nice. Not that far away from the copper deposit either. I call that an absolute win. it with a life support pack. Technology recharge. Oh, yeah, that's right. I need that terrain. That. 
Oh, jeez. Oh, boy. All right. I'm falling into... Falling into the thing. That's not good. All right. Well. Doing good so far. Just need to get more copper in the future. Constantly get more copper. There's no reason to not get copper. That is what I've learned from this little escapade. Is that we always need more copper. It's a never ending search for more copper. That's what I've learned. Alright. So, what do we got? We got salt. More copper! Alrighty. And it's not that far away either. Okay. So far so good. Whoops. Forgot that I do not have that long a charge on it. Whoopsie doopsie. Alright. This is just pure salt. The fact that it's green is weird to me. <laughs> Hello. You are one weird looking motherfucker. Alright. Alright. Miss some. There we go. All that good. Now I just need to go back to my ship, which is going to be a trick in and of itself. So I don't know where to put my ship. Unknown building. Huh? And the cargo drop. Alright, uh, we're going to go towards that. And we're going to also check what time I'm at. Okay. I'm good. We're also going to do the cargo drop. It's right there, I'm assuming. Ah, owie. Container. Now that I've learned that I can just dispose of them, get at the stuff inside. Viking effigy. Oh. Viking effigy. Interesting. Starship out of range. That explains why that's doing that. Alright. Uh, bolt caster requires a lot of chromatic metal. And then the carbon nanotubes, which I will deal with later. Um, charge that with that. Because I have so much of that. And then charge this with... Yeah, let's charge this with the carbon. It's proper carbon go. Go over to it until we're basically right on top of it. And then there we go. Okay. Oops, that's not what I meant. I meant to switch that to restore. Change size. Oh, 
Interesting. Didn't know I could change the size of it. That's about as far as I can go with how big it'll go. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, yeah, just warn me when it's at 50%, would you? It's the only time it matters to me. There's the minor settlement. It's about 15 hours away from me if I walk my normal speed. Interesting. Hmm. It's a pirate deposit. You know, cactus, knowledge stone, and an unknown building. I'm getting very far away from my stuff. But... Exploration must be had. Exploration must be done for the good of me, mainly. Another journey milestone, huh? The Nomad. Okay. Now that I know that I can skip those, it takes so much time, I'm just going to skip them. What is that on the thing? There's two knowledge stones that are on this building, and then a big ball thing. moving. Oh, I can move the ball. <laughs> okay. Alright. That explains that a little bit. Viking plaque. Oh. The imprint of an ancient civilization was once absorbed by the strange marker. The story of the Viking somehow spills out in the language of my own people. Noble travelers will be spared. Their journey through the cosmos shall not be thwarted. So it is decreed. The will of Herc commands it. The Viking shall honor the judgment and the belief of the ancients. Seek help with the language. My knowledge of the Viking increases. Not a good idea. Ba -ba -da -ba. Okay. Well, I didn't hurt myself too bad. Oh, hey. If I'm in here, it counts as a building. Hey, I'll take it. Alright. Gives me a second to relax, at least. It's a cargo drop. It's a salt deposit. Where was the copper deposit? Right over there. It's also a knowledge stone and a buried technology module. They aren't that far away from each other. Well, in that case, we'll go towards the knowledge stone and then uh, copper deposit and then the uh, buried technology thing. That sounds good to me. The fact that I can't sprint and have my scanner open at the same time bugs me. But I guess it makes sense. Oop. All right. Yeah, makes sense. I'd be surprised if it wasn't falling. But what? Okay, I got a microprocessor out of that. Okay. Metal. Got a micro.
microprocessor out of that. And... The fact that these two are combined with each other is fucking funny to me. <laughs> oh, that's funny. It, they're, they're both... They're both two cargo drops in one spot. That is fucking hilarious. Oopsie doodle. Gotta love the little shenanigans. Hmm. There's another knowledge stone and another. I wonder if I'll start coming across the knowledge stones that I've already done. This is copper. That's fine by me. Go for the copper one first. Because I need that more. Alright, didn't expect to fall into the hole with it, but alright. There we go. That is a big old crystal. Ow. I need an advanced mining laser for it. Damn it. I always need an advanced mining laser. I don't know how to make one, though. Oh. Oh. Is what it is, I guess. It's the knowledge stone. That's a big old rock right there. It's the other knowledge stone. And there's... I think the one I already did. I think. I feel like I already did that one. Probably did. Feel so Support systems at fifty percent. Yeah, that's fine. There's that one. There's that one. Salvage container. There's that. Where was the? Data structure, huh? Ow. That's a bunch of carbon crystals. I know there was. I know there was a big old friggin'. There it is. Buried technology module. That's what I was looking for. Just couldn't find it. And let go this way. There we go. Got it. Swap it to restore. Okay. There we go. Took a little while, but we got there in the end. Oh, find a nickel. <laughs> Alright. Oh, that's what you want. Wondering what that noise was. Huh. I can never be too sure which ones are the ones I did or not. Let's fuck it. Double check this one real quick, I guess. Ow. No, I did not. 
Oh, good thing I checked. Oops. If I keep the word for um, I keep hitting the wrong button, but I mean to do this. All right. And we'll... Oh, the ion battery is for that. Interesting indeed. Technology recharge. Cool. Beautiful. Does that actually get it off my No it doesn't. So Scholar. Okay. I'm gonna learn sixteen words in a second. Keen word for not. Not, not? Cannot, not. I don't know where I'm referencing that bit from. That's a cop. Didn't I just harvest that copper deposit? Didn't I just do that? I swear I did. This one and this one I was unsure of. Salvage container. It's a hazardous floor. Okay. Time to walk towards this one. See if I did it or not. I did not. Good. It's worthwhile. We're in. Alright, and then there's the other one. The question is, can I do... No, I can't. It requires an advanced mining laser. God damn it. Alright. Okay, I guess. Alright. Knowledge stone. This. <laughs> Not in this. Okay, well. Where's my ship? Where's my god's damn ship? Where did I put my ship? Salt deposit. That's a copper deposit. Buried cash. Where is my ship? There is my ship. It is over there. Alright, well. Time to head back to the ship. I think. Considering how long it'll take me to get there. Oop. Ow. Ow. Just fell down even further than I wanted to. Damn it. Alright. Okay. So far, so good. So far, so good on this planet. Just need to get back to my ship. Then we can get back to my base. And we can consider all of this good. Oh! So sprint's a toggle. I don't actually have to hold it down. That's news to me. very helpful as well. Ow. Man, there's so many large creatures that make my camera shake if I walk past them. It's progress. At least I'm making progress. What is 
this marker for anyway? The S marker. Oh! For the directions of the poles, north and south. That makes sense. It's the minor settlement. I might visit there. But first I have to make sure that I have things. Ooh. Small wooden icon carved into the shape of a sentinel drone. Used by warriors to enter a temporary trance-like state that eliminates their kind's need for sleep. I don't know about that one, but it sells for quite a bit, so I'll take it. Nothing else, it can be sold for quite a bit. What is this? Oh, that's a hazardous flora. That's that one thing of a jig. Doesn't like people next to it. This one's a copper deposit and a pirate deposit. Okay. Well, I mean, if it's on the way, <laughs> might as well do it. Right? Your ability to walk is really weird. I'm just going to say that now. Okay. And we are almost to the Knowledge Stone, and then we'll redirect ourselves right back to... Direct ourselves right back to our ship. But uh For with, okay. With what? Uh, why am I the way I am? Okay. Well, up the mountain we go to get to where we need to go. But there's no way I can climb this mountain like that. I mean, if I'm right here. I might as well, right? If I'm right here. Especially since I need copper so badly in the first place that I did this fuck all big ass trek to even get here. Then, yeah, I probably should. There we go. Okay, well. There's that. I think everything of this little deposit. I wonder if I... Wait, this is also copper. Why would I... Why would I not? Why would I not? Oh, I'm going crazy for copper. Oh my god. <laughs> I've become crazed with copper. Okay. There we go. Ow. Okay. All right. And salt. Copper. No, no, no. I'm going towards my ship. That is what I meant to do. That is pirate deposit anyway. No point. There's no point. Oh, that was going to hurt a lot anyway. Oh, Jesus. Oh, gosh. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, gosh. That's what we're going to make some lift off fuel anyway. Pyrite. 
Yep, don't need it. Stop getting distracted and just go for my ship. That is what I need. That is what I should be doing. Oh, look, another ship. Y'all didn't fuck with my ship, did you? you? Better not have. I will shoot you down. I don't give no fucks. I don't give any fucks. You fuck with my ship, I fuck with you. Almost there. We are so close. Oh, but there's an olive stone. No, no. But since we are within a stone store, I'm going to fuck around a little bit. Gather. needed. There we are. You look not good. I will get rid of you simply because you look not good. There we go. Oh shit. Ow. That was a noise I didn't expect out of that. Oh! Owie! Wasn't anything else near me other than that, was it? I don't think it was. Okay, there we go. Good. Oh, you little shit. There's so many of them around my ship. Why did I set down where there's so many around my ship. Alright. Okay. Get into my ship. Uh, I guess... I can't do that yet. Um, Starship uh, launcher fuel. How do I make that again? Get. Uh, oops, that's not what I wanted. I wanted to make this thing. I needed metal plating. And now I can make that. And now I can fill this up with this. Good. Closer to where my base actually is. Probably a better idea. Or I could go to where that minor settlement is. That would be possibly a good idea, just so I could see what the settlement is about. Although it will take a long time to get there. It'll take at least an hour. But still, might be worth it. But if it is actually going to take an hour... Eh. Oh, I can! I was curious. Okay. And arrive near the settlement in five seconds. That is a very small settlement. Let me land. Nice. 
I wonder, is it free if I launch from here? Is that a good question? I did reach the destination. That is the thing I did. Nothing found. Got a microprocessor. And... I got whatever this is. Another microprocessor. Okay. Boy. Nothing but microprocessors out here. Oh! Oh, hi! Hi there. Stasis Entangler. It's a weapon terminal. Oh! Wowzers! That is an A-class. Compare that with my current multi-tool. I mean... <laughs> it's not even a fucking... It's not even really a contest. <laughs> I mean, shit. Let's exchange... Oh! I can't trade in current multi-tool for that. Wowzers. Uh, that costs a lot of money. <laughs> a lot of money I don't have currently. Extract nine eyes, huh? Hi there, scout. Are you on? Are you on? I don't know how to pronounce your name. Let me see if I can talk to you a little more. The warrior's nostrils flare as I approach. They inhale deeply, tasting the desert air that has followed me into this once sterile facility. They bark out what could be a warning. I hurriedly mime that I am peaceful and know little of their kind or language. Pathetic interloper. Lahun Warrior. Take a second to think, then grab my multi-tool while barking again into my visor, streaking it with saliva. They point at the mining beam charge indicator, then at my backpack. Um... That'd be carbon, right? Warrior grunts in satisfaction. Impressed at both my gift and my understanding, they teach me several new words of their language. Hey! Oh! Cool! Thank you, dude. Technology Merchant Sendes... Sendings. I don't fucking know how to pronounce that name. Fluent. Ooh, I learned fluent. I learned to be fluent, or fluent enough. Technology merchant Zendengs. Uses wares include brute blueprints. Blueprints. <laughs> that was what I was about to say. Jesus. Ah! My brain is broken. Blueprints for craftable technology, as well as many of the components required to craft them. I'd rather just get blueprints. I'll be honest here. Oh! And I buy them for nanite clusters. Interesting. I do have a lot of those. Teleport receiver. Uh, device that modulates standard starship communication signals to enable the transport of matter as well as data. Starships fitted with such a device can send and receive products and substances to a user's exosuit over a long distance. Oh, that seems so useful. But that's even more useful! <sighs> Replaces standard mining beam optics with high-grade living glass allowing the beam to be effective against large and or rare resource deposits. The lens adapts automatically to minute fluctuations in the beam, in the beam waveform, minimizing scatter and increasing device mining potential. Oh boy! There's a lot of stuff that I could really, really, really use. That is definitely something I need. Something I need. That is something I need! All right. 
neural stimulator. Increases the capacity of the jetpack tanks and adrenal pump reserves, allowing the user to both fly and sprint longer. That would be useful, but I currently am not that rank of Viking uh, friendly yet, unfortunately. Waveform recycler increases potential scan frequency. That would be nice. Uh, this is far more useful than that currently. I will, however, get this someday. But this, this gets so many things out of the way for me. Technology recorded to catalog. Oh, boy. This would... Installing the technology, technology would allow it to be advanced mining laser. If they need her hermetic seal, carbon nanotubes, and wiring loom. What the fuck is that? Uh, fuck. How do I make that? <laughs> Shit. Shit, fuck, damn it. I don't even know! But, uh, I think that's a trade... Yes, it is. A trade terminal. Ha-ha! With that, I shall... sell some of my shit. Some of my shit that I don't need. In particular. Uh, the demand for that isn't that high. Um, projectile ammunition. I do not need this for that. I don't think. Yeah. I don't think I need that. I could use that. I, <laughs> I find it hilarious that I managed to find microprocessors after I bought them. <laughs> I feel so annoyed that that is what happened. I don't need that. I don't need that. I don't need this. Um, hmm. Gold. There's not that much demand for these. There is for the magnetized ferrite, but not for the precious metals, which I find weird. But, alright. If you say so. Game. Alright. There we go. Good. Um, I don't know why I did that. Um, what I wanted was to do this. Um, put that in there. Technology uh, uh, pulse engine. Fill that with pyrite. Technology recharge. There we go. Um... I'm really hoping that the launch from here will be uh, a little bit technically free, because I hate having to constantly make stuff. <laughs> Alright. The hydrogen metal plating. I'm going to move that here and craft more. I need one metal plating. Oh, so I need to make a lot of metal platings if I need to do that. Okay, I'm missing components. And there we go. Okay, that covers that, at least. Um, please tell me it's free. Please tell me it's free. Please tell me it's free. And... Oh, it is free. Okay, awesome. Well, um, I have gone for a very long time in this episode because I keep wanting to find more shit because this game is really, really engaging my oh, I need to see, I need to explore, I need to do, I need to do, I need to explore, I need to do fucking 
synapses in my brain that make me want to do things, that make me want to see things. So uh, I'm going to end the episode before that continues on any further. I'm going to see y'all back with my personal base colony. And uh, from there, we will just... Yep, just do things again. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to end the episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat playing games. And fucking, I am so excited about exploring and doing things. Especially now that I seem to be making progress. And I feel like I'm making progress. Uh, I was overwhelmed at first when I first got into it. And now I am so excited because now I, it seems to mesh into my brain what I'm doing. And I just can't wait for the next episode. I want to do more. So we'll see you very soon. For you.